Maddie. We met almost exactly 10 years ago today, but it feels like I've known you my whole life. You have proven to me time and time again how strong, brave, and wonderful you are. Ashley, I can't believe that our day is finally here. I am so excited for our future together. I have never doubted your love for me, but this past year together truly tested our love for one another. And you, Ashley, showed me that even through our darkest days, <clears throat> I know with my whole heart and soul that you will be by my side. The past year has made us grow as a couple, but also individually. There is nothing we can't do together. Sometimes God throws us curveballs before we are ready for them, but that's life, isn't it? Before Matt's big surgery, he texted me. He said, there's only one thing I want from you. If the worst case scenario happens, I just want you to make sure Ashley's gonna be okay. And I said, of course, that's not gonna happen, but absolutely. And thank goodness he came out like a champ there's no doubt in my mind that Ashley was the reason Matt was able to make it through and fight like he did. So. I can't wait to become Mrs. Hale in a few hours and spend the rest of my life laughing through life with you. You are my best friend and hero forever. I love you more than you will ever know. So I'll shoot you straight. Today we start our journey together as man and wife and I'm can confidently say that no one, nothing will break our bond. You are the most beautiful woman on this earth. In my eyes, your smile, your beautiful blue eyes remind me daily that I am truly the luckiest man on earth. I hope you know my immense feeling of pride that I have knowing that you are going to be my wife. I love you with all of my heart, sweetness. I do. You are gorgeous. The choice is that we I am um, Ashley's best friend. I'd like to think so. Right? We're good. I check in about once a week. Uh, we're still good so far. 12 years going strong. But I actually met Ashley freshman year of college. We were random roommates. Uh, she told me about Matt pretty soon after we met. Oh. And she told me about this guy. And uh, it took me a while to come around because I said, Ashley, this guy doesn't like you. Uh, <laughs> why haven't I met him? Uh, but she was so focused and committed to this guy that she would go on dates and she'd come home and she'd talk about Matt Hale, this mysterious guy to me. And I'm like, stop. Uh, and then Matt came around and I fell in love with him and I, to this day, am his little sister. That's what he calls me. Dear okay. Lord, we thank you for today. We thank you for this wonderful group of women that has stood by Ashley and Matt. We are here with them through thick and thin to bless this marriage and be their support system, Lord. We thank you for this opportunity to celebrate the two of them. We thank you for your son, Jesus, your grace that you give us. In your name we pray. Amen. Amen. When he was in Knoxville and I was still here in Nashville, you know, we, we'd catch up on the phone, talk about the Titans or 
how bad UT football is, how great Vanderbilt is. Um, and then all of a sudden he started talking about this girl. And thank God that girl ended up being Ashley because uh, you make Matt so happy. You've been such a blessing to him and, and our whole family. Watching you grow from our little girl into the beautiful bride here today has filled us with so much joy and happiness. We are so blessed to welcome Matt into our family and thank him for the laughter and happiness he brings you. Sometimes when couples get together, they absorb the other person's likes or dislikes or whatever, and the two, I mean, maybe it sounds sweet that they become one, but the thing that I like about you is you still remain your individual people and you love her unconditionally and she loves you unconditionally but you're different neither tries to change the other and that is so important in a relationship just letting each other be who they are and loving them for all of the reasons you fell in love to begin with and not trying to change the other so kudos to you working that out today i give myself to you in marriage i promise to encourage and inspire you I promise to encourage and inspire you. To laugh with you and to comfort you. To laugh with you and to comfort you. In times of sorrow and struggle. In times of sorrow and struggle. And to always hold you in the highest regard. And to always hold you in the highest regard. Today I give myself to you in marriage. I promise to encourage and inspire you. I promise to encourage and inspire you. To laugh with you and to comfort you. To laugh with you and to comfort you. And to always hold you in highest regard. And to always hide, hide you. <laughs> hold you in, in highest, highest regard. regard. Wow. These things I give to you. These things I give to you. Today. Today. And all the days of our life. And all the days of our life. Now that Ashley and Matt have given themselves to each other in the solemn exchange of vows and rings, I formally and officially announce that they are lawfully married, husband and wife, those whom God has joined together, let no one put asunder. You may kiss your bride. It is my privilege and honor to introduce for the very first time, Mr. and Mrs. Matthew Hale. Yeah. 